Good afternoon to you all. We are here at Sivo Stadium this afternoon in Nilongwe where Malawi is meeting Egypt in the world qualifying series and this is the first leg match. At the moment, the two teams have actually gone on the pitch and they are waiting for the officials to come and greet them or rather to be introduced to them. And uh, as far as I can see, the match commissioner is uh, uh, Mr. Nelson Chirwa the former Malawian referee. Um, the referee is from Tanzania, Hafid Ali, first linesman Joseph Mapunda from Tanzania, and second linesman is Sa Said or Saidi Alamas from Tanzania. So it is indeed. Uh, if we can probably just go back a little bit to see how the Egyptians have fared against Malawi. Uh, in 1978 in Nigeria during the All Africa Games, uh, Egypt beat Malawi by four goals to one. But in 1987, Malawi beat uh, Egypt by two goals to one at the All Africa Games in um, uh, at Nyayo Stadium in Kenya. And a moment from now, I think. Yes, indeed, uh, you've just heard the two national themes. The first one was for Egypt, and the second one, of course, is for Malawi. Right now, the officials have gone to be introduced, and guest of honor is the Minister of Local Government, Ms. Honorable Mwanjas Mwakikunga, who is actually being introduced to the Malawi players first. Yes, to the officiating personnel. As I said earlier on, the referee is from Tanzania, Hafid Ali, and the first linesman is Joseph Mapunda, the second linesman is Sadi Alamas, and substitute referee is Sandy Shikandira from Malawi. But both the referee and the linesman are from uh, Tanzania. And right now we have the, uh, the Honorable Makunga being introduced to the Egyptian players. And uh, as usual, yes, you start with the visitors and then go to your own uh, team. So right now, the Honorable Makikunga and Mr. Nelson Chirwa, who is the match commissioner, is actually going to the Malawi national side, side. Young Chimozi, and uh, is actually introduced to Gilbert Chirwa, McDonald Singo, uh, Felix Nirongo, Frank Sinalo, Patson Amari, Ganzani Masie, who's got a very difficult task, 
and uh, yes, home and Marunga, and uh, Peter Ginskaida, uh, Charles Pity, and indeed all the all the players and um, uh, team coaches and the team doctor and team uh, team manager. So right now. Um, this match, the one which everybody has been waiting for this afternoon, will kick off. And yes, indeed, that's the end of that ceremony. And we're just waiting to see the bowing ceremony. And uh, right now, young Chimozi is actually jogging, coming back to take his place. And. Uh, Yes, Mr. Nelson Chirwa is also there. After taking photographs, the officials have gone back to take their seats. And after that, yes, there is a bowing ceremony. And yes, indeed, the Malawi national team. The Malawi national team going on the pitch. The Egyptians greeting the crowd. The Malawi national team in the center circle greeting the crowd. Yes, and the crowd is reciprocating. Yes, the Egyptians have gone to greet uh, the soccer fans here at Sibo Stadium. And uh, by the look of things, it seems as everything is boiling up now to start off. And calling the two captains, the captain for Egypt is Gamal Abdul Hamid, 31 years of, of age. And for Malawi is of course Young Chimozi, and definitely Young Chimozi is remembered by Egyptians as they exchange um, souvenirs, exchanging souvenirs. They remember him very well because he scored a goal against Egypt in um, Kenya in 1987 in August during the All Africa Games soccer tournament. And uh, every player on the pitch is trying to warm up himself. And they're trying to decide which side are you starting with. And let us wait and see. Um, yes, the linesman wishing, uh, the, the referee wishing his linesman a better game. So too is the other linesman. So we really are in real big, a big challenge today when we're facing the Egyptians. But as usual, we have met them twice. They beat Malawi in 1978 on the 18th of July in uh, Algeria. And by the look of things, Malawi is going to defend the Northern Goal. And they are wearing all white. The Egyptians are wearing white shorts and socks, but red tops. Yes, they beat Malawi in 1978 on the 18th of July by four goals to one, and the only lone goal scored by Kinapiri. And uh, in 1987, then it's something that they'll never forget. Malawi beat Egypt by two goals to one, thereby confusing almost everybody at the end of that match. And the game has kicked off already. We are six seconds away as the Egyptians. Now this is Malawi's Charles Piri. Charles Piri. Gilbert Chirwa and there it goes and it's offside against Malawi offside against Malawi yes indeed the Egyptians are taking a free kick the first free kick after 35 seconds state of affairs is still zero zero and just to run up um, for Malawi we have Ganzan Masie in goals that's the biggest challenge for Ganzan Masie who has never been featured in any international match and for him it's the biggest challenge to prove himself that he's actually worth his inclusion in the national team and uh, that is after of course Donix Gondwe got injured so we have Pato Namari wearing shirt number two. Four is Peter Kinskaida. Five is Gilbert Chirwa. Six, Charles Piri. 
seven, the ball has gone out for a goal kick, the first goal kick for Malawi. Young Chimozi, seven, age is 27. And indeed, Ganzan Masia, 21 years of age. Patsuna Mwari, wearing shirt number two, 20 years of age. A very young player indeed. Four is Peter Ginskaida, 27. Six, uh, uh, five, Gilbert Chirwa, 26. And here come the Egyptians. Young Chimozi playing the ball away. The Egyptians again attack, but it's cleared away. Charles Peary there, but the ball goes away into touch. And number seven, Young Chimozi, 27. Eight, Clifton Msia wearing shirt number 20, uh, uh, eight. Yes, age is 24 years of age. Frank Sinalo is 26, wearing shirt number nine. Ten, Homan Malunga, 24. And of course, 12, Felix Sinirongo, 25. 14 is McDonald Singo, 22. Substitutes, we have Peter Gins Nkunga, number, 20, uh, number three. Age 24, 11 Zexla Jabu, 24 years of age, 13 Austin Nyondo, 23, 15 Mabuto Lungu, the youngest of them all, 19 years of age, 21 is Patrick Shimulambe, 19 years of age, and here come Malawi, the Egyptians. There was a push, according to the, the referee from Tanzania, uh, Hafid Ali. So it must be a free kick to the Egyptians. We're almost two minutes for the six seconds gone. This crucial match. The Egyptians at the moment leading that this group by two points after beating Liberia and Malawi after drawing with Kenya. Of course, they had a better, uh, they had an advantage because having drawn with the Kenyans. But if if the Kenyans come here and then they just manage to do a draw, then Malawi will definitely have another chance. The Egyptians must always be attacked. This is Gilbert Chirwa. Sharing it again with McDonald Singo, shifting it forward for Lawrence. Uh, in actual fact, it's Frank Sinalo. So for Egyptians, Egypt, you have Shobia Aham, 27, two Ibrahim Hassan, 21 years of age, and three is Hane Ramsey, 20, 20 years of age. Yes, number four is Aham Ramsey, 23. And number five is Hesham Yakani, 24 years of age. Six, Ashraf Kasem, 24. And seven, Ahmed Abdu Kasi. His, the nickname there is Kasi. And the brilliant dribble there, beautiful play by Gilbert Chirwa. Yes, that was a crude dribble. Beating Ahmed Abdu Kasi. Lovely ball. And uh, Ahmed Abdu, yes, Kasi, 24 years of age. The one who has just been beaten. Uh, by Gilbert Chirwa in a brilliant manner. And there is Gilbert Chirwa heading it first time. And number eight is Magda Abdulegani who plays in, uh, in Portugal for Porto. He's 28 years of age. That's the only professional they have. A bad throw. Yes, indeed, like a mango. And it must be a throw into Malawi. Gilbert Chirwa to take from the western touchline. The Egyptians are defending the southern one. There is the captain of the side, Young Chimozi. Chimozi putting the ball again wide to Mpatsonamari and a long ball well intercepted there by the Egyptians. And this is Abdulagani, the most dangerous player for the Egyptians. He plays professional in Portugal. And yes, they must be attacked and close. And they have gone now. Peter Ginskaida going up as, as, as much as also defending. Malawi has just considered a, a throw in there. Um, very dangerous position indeed, particularly when it is about two, three, four, five meters away from the corner flag, and they are taking it from the western zone. And dangerously they come, but well intercepted. This is Charles Piri, a long ball to Frank Sinalo, but the Egyptians are everywhere. And number nine is Mark Abdulagan. Of course, number eight is Mark Abdulagan, the only professional who came in last Wednesday from Port Portugal, where he plays for Pocho. Whatever has happened, the referee knows better. And number nine is Ala Mayub, 27. Number 10, Gamal Abdul Hamid, that's their prolific striker, number 10. And number 11 is Tariq Soliman, who is 26 years of age. The substitutes are Rabi Yassin, 29, wearing shirt number 14. And 15, Khaled Idi, 24. 16, Mohammed Ramadan, 27. That's one of the players who featured in the All Africa Games. Uh, when Malawi beat them by two goals to one in 
And that's definitely Kaida and it misplaces a pass. This is one thing the players have got to make sure that they check when they are making their passes. Clifton. Six minutes, 37 seconds gone. And these boys must not cross. Yes. They are taking another throw in. Aham Duramze cross inside. And badly cleared. Look at this. Oh, that's a corner. No, it's offside. Yes. Guns and Masie. That was a... Um, well, we have survived a, a close chance to the Egyptians there. It was a close chance to the Egyptians. Zanmasie for the first time wearing Malawi colors, defending the northern goalpost. A long ball, Frank Sinalo. But the Egyptians, I think the best Malawi can do is to put the ball on the ground. Because the, the Egyptians seem to be winning all aerial balls. But there in Ramadan, um, Abdul Ghani was in trouble with uh, um, Frank Sinalo. He's trying to show them that despite the fact that they are enjoying high advantage, he can also jump over them. And this is a loose ball. The Egyptians still inside their half, playing short one. They are coming like bees all at the same time. Mm. Beautiful, but only the opposition. And there is nobody. Shoo. Ramadan uh, Abdul Ghani. And they let somebody to cross from there. That's dangerous. And that's the first corner. Eight minutes, 33 seconds. Malawi, zero. Egypt, zero. As they are taking their corner, the first corner, in this match from the Eastern Zone. And Tarek Saliman, 26 years of age, is taking that one. Well intercepted there. Clifton Msia, brilliantly done. And if they only accepted Msia, accelerate from there, then they must know they were in trouble. Clifton in Sia, after playing in the midfield for some, quite some time now, has come back to play as a left back. And the Egyptians cross it well. And this is McDonald Singo. Beautiful. Frank Sinalo. Singo again. And this is Gilbert Chirwa. Yes. Brilliant play there. Back to the goalkeeper. By Gilbert. Nine minutes, 46 seconds gone. And there it goes from the shortest man on the pitch. Brilliant play there. Homan Malunga. Homan. And they shot there. Dangerous. Beautiful shot. And what a brilliant move by Homan Malunga. Giving it to Clifton and Sia. And he crossed it well. After 10 minutes. And the goalkeeper Shobia did well to save that ball because that should have been a damaging blow to them. The Egyptians, the Egyptians haven't done badly though in the, uh, the continental football. They, are the, they have won the Africa Cup of Nations three times. Yes, the Egyptians won the Africa Cup of Nations three times. They won it in 1957 when it was just introduced. Um, when they beat Ethiopia in Sudan by four goals to zero. And in 1959, they beat Sudan in Cairo 2-1. And in 1986, they qualified into the uh, 1962 Egypt, lost to Sudan in Cairo, not Ethiopia, uh, in, in Ethiopia by four goals to two. And the last time the Egyptians grabbed the, East, the National African Cup of Nations, was in 1986 after beating Cameroon on penalty shootouts in 1986.
5-4 in Cairo. And here they are, Malawi, uh, on the regional level, they haven't done badly though. They have won the Eastern Central Africa Challenge Cup three times. First was in 1978 at Kamuzu Stadium on the 19th of November. And... Yes, that was a bad tackle by the Egyptian uh, player there wearing shirt number 13 is Hesham Abdul Rasul and yes they returned it in 1979 that definitely I should have prayed for that one to go for a corner but it's not yet out and Frank Sinal has gone to challenge the Egyptians are building up themselves from the back they must yes there is a loose ball a gift to Homan and this is Gilbert Chirwa back again to Young Chimodzi up front and brilliantly done there from Frank Sinalo and brilliant, brilliant play. Oh, yes, Gilbert trying it all him by himself. Chested. This is a dangerous boy, Gamal Abdul Hamid, the captain. Gamal leading it again. Ahmed Abdu. Young Chimodzi has gone to challenge. This is Abdul Hamid. But there is Felix Nyirongo. Ow! He misses it. Oh! Back to the goalkeeper. 12 minutes, 59 seconds gone. And it's still 0-0. Zero, zero. Egypt 0, Malawi 0. Yes, so Malawi are the current Eastern Central Africa champions after beating Zambia by three goals to one. Uh, on the 19th of November, a Saturday. And here they come now. Clifton Msia, a short one. And again, this is Homan Malunga. Short. Gilbert must float it, yes. And he floats it high. But it goes to the goalkeeper, Shobia, Ahamd. Look at him. The player with, with, who was with the Egyptians, I think, uh, in 1987, when they lost 2-1, has not been included, but Shabia was as a sub, played as a substitute. And um, I don't know whether it was Shabia himself when Malawi uh, beat Egypt in 1987, was in goals. That remains to be seen. And this is Young Chimoti. And Frank Sinalo. And a shot! Certainly, it's quite a good game. It's quite a very, very good game. There's no doubt about that. I think there has been quite good, good coaching on the part of Malola. It looks as things are working well at the moment, although it's zero-zero. And they have got very, very furious counter-attacks. The Egyptians, and so far, so good. Malawi can manage to do that. Clifton in Sia. Um, uh, uh, yes, it was Peter Ginsgaida jumping almost twice a tall man and managed to get that ball. This is a dangerous moment for Malawi. And back there play, playing supporting football and it goes away. Yes, it goes away for a goal kick. 15 minutes, 29 seconds gone. Malawi zero, Egypt zero. A long, long ball from the goalkeeper himself, headed back by the Egyptians. Headed first time, back again to Homan Malunga. This is now Homan. Homan. Homan is pushed in the process. Frank Snarrow tries that one, but the Egyptians take over easily. Here they come. This is... And don't accept them to go past you. Just tight mark them. Dangerous, headed away. Kaida. Oh, he 
He gives it to the opposition. And in see, I was too deep. Beautiful defensive job there by Peter Kinskaya. Egyptians are going. Cut away. Back. Supporting. Beautiful play there by Kaida. He's doing a fantastic job. Brilliant. Charles Piri now. Hey, he's swept. But back again. Pass on Amari. Cross it. And it comes. Oh! He wanted it on the volley. Peter Kinskaida was waiting for it on the ground. And it comes. Gentlemen, take advantage of that. Quickly pass it on. Quickly, just do it quickly. Take advantage of that when the Egyptians are not around. That's it. Namwari. Shimozi as captain of the side this afternoon. Still in possession. Gilbert. Frank. Gilbert. Brilliant. Shot blocked. Felix. And this is trouble. This is real trouble. Abdul Hamid. What a job. Yes, it must be. It must be a free kick, yes. After home and Malhunga was cruelly tackled. Young Chimoti almost saved us there. It was dangerous. And now he's going to take a free kick himself. Deep inside the Egyptian half. And it comes, it goes. But headed back. This is, yes, Ahmed Ramsey putting the ball back for support. And again, Ibrahim Hassan. 19 minutes, 22 seconds gone. This is their maximum, their star, ah, Magda Abdullah And again, And McDonald Singo heading the ball away. Headed back to Charles Piri. Piri now putting it to Clifton, but he's not there. Frank Snaro tries to go for that ball. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. It must be. It must be. A throw in to Malawi. Clifton MC had to take. Wearing shirt number eight. Whatever happened. Felix Nyirongo being booked by this Hafid. The Tanzanian referee Hafid Ali. The Egyptians clearing a long ball. Gilbert Chirwa has got enough time even to finish a hot cup of coffee before the opposition come in. Yes. The crowd, the capacity crowd here. A long, long ball. The Egyptians are the first ones to arrive in the air. And this is Hesham Abdul Abdu and Clifton Msia. Clifton Msia, there is trouble. Clifton, 
Shot! And it goes! Sinala! And it goes away! It goes away! Christian and Sia breaking the path for the first time on the left wing, crossed it in exceptional well. And there was Clifton, uh, Frank Sinaro. He nearly got it right. And I'm sure if you only manage to get that goal, then, then, in Cairo, it should have been the survival of the fittest in August. I think we can beat them. And don't give them chance to shoot. Tarek Solimani. Yes. In trouble. He is in trouble. His muscles are not working properly. And there is Gilbert Chirwa playing the ball back. There is a chance, and a shot, oh what a shot by Sinalo, oh! Brilliant play! Ah! Oh. Very bad! Charles should have definitely shouted on that one. And it goes three, it goes through two Malawian uh, players and going into touch to the Egyptians uh, throw in. But nevertheless, they are inside, deep inside their half. Whatever happens, and this is Gamal Abdul Hamid. And again, Mati Abdul Ghani back again. Yes, Hesham Abdul Rasul. And then Abdul Ghan again. Ahmed Abdul Abdu Kasi. And he zooms away into touch. So far, so good. For everybody, 23 minutes, 24 minutes exactly gone. And Egypt, zero, Malawi, zero. Quite a lovely match indeed this afternoon. Frank Sinaro goes to try a header, and from there now Frank Sinaro goes, but oh, he's headed away. There goes Barton Amari in the air, beating a man with a header. Felix plays it wide. Yes, first time to Gilbert Chirwa. Floating a high one inside the box there, Jeff Frank Sinaro. Oh, what a header! What a header! Yes. 24 minutes. Beautiful play by Frank Sinalo. Oh. And that goes away into touch. We can contain them. And it's very important for us to contain them. Brilliant play by Magdalena Singo. And there he goes to challenge. This is Shobia, the goalkeeper for Egypt. Aham, 27 years of age, bouncing it only one time. A long ball up. And then Patson Amari has got that job of heading that ball into touch, yes. Yes, the Egyptians are quite tall if we talk in terms of height. They are really enjoying that height advantage. But Malawi are players who are definitely, uh, on the average, they are short, but they are trying to beat them in the air. This is very, very, um, very good indeed. A goal kick to Malawi. 26 minutes, 5 seconds gone. Ganzan Masie, goalkeeper for Malawi. What a crucial moment for him. 
He must be saying, well, I just have to accept. And this is something that has always got, got to be practiced. You have got to make sure you've got a, another player who can be relied on as the existing one in case somebody go, gets an injury just exactly the same as what, is, what Malawi is facing right now Donix Gondwe having been injured in a plaster and this is now a brilliant boo picked up this is their maxman Magda Abdulugani And now Clifton Msia has got to contain that one. And whether and it goes away for a corner. The second corner, the Egyptians. 27 minutes, 25 seconds gone. Yes, when I was speaking to one, one Egyptian at uh, Lilongwe Hotel the other time I was interviewing them, they said it will be a cup final and indeed it looks like a cup final. Survive of the fittest, law of the jungle. And the Egyptians are running there to just to take, a, to take a short corner chested. And again for another corner. 27 minutes, 28 exactly gone. The Egyptians are taking two corners in succession. Malawi zero, Egypt zero. The Egyptians are taking a corner and a dangerous one. Brilliant job done by Frank Sinalo there. Indeed, it was a brilliant job. You can't even know who is the striker today on the Malawi side. Everybody seems to come back to defend, go up front and support. This is the way I think football has got to be play, played because particularly when you're playing against the Egyptians they're so furious when they are counter-attack Now, Malawi, Frank Sinalo misses that one The Egyptians now, back This is now Abdul Hamid And Brilliantly played Sinalo 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 Ah. Oh. Brilliant done. Young Chimoti. The Egyptians remember him well. He damaged them. This is now Homan Malunga. Yes. Homan. It goes into the body of an opponent. It comes back to Homan. Homan. Yes. It must be a free kick to Malawi inside, yes. The Egyptian half on the eastern touchline. Patson Amari taking it. A long, long ball! Ah! If there was somebody just to hammer that one, the goalkeeper had moved away from his usual position. Now this is Egypt. Egypt. Egypt, Tarek Suleiman. Counter attacking again. Badly done. Yes, it must be a goal kick. It went via the net. It must be a, a, a goal kick, yes. 15 minutes to go to the end of the first half. State of affairs 0 0, Egypt 0. Malawi, zero. This is exactly what Ruben Malola said. Uh, if we beat them in Kenya 2-1, why can't we do it the same today? And Homan Malunga plays the ball back. Young Chimoti to... Yes, Patsonamari, 19 years of age. 
and back again to the captain of the side. Frank Sinalo, brilliant job. Oh man, Malunga, what a shot! What a shot! By Homan Malunga. Great! Beautiful football being played by Malawi here. Hubert Chirwa taking a throw in inside the Egyptian's half. The first corner for Malawi. First corner for Malawi. And it's 32 minutes gone. Homan Marunga taking a corner from the western touchline. Yes, well positioned. Frank Sinalo is waiting for it in the box. And there comes a corner. And it goes away. Patron Amari fires it back. But it goes into touch. This is beautiful football being played by Malawi and Egypt, Egypt here. And everybody seems to have done quite a very good homework before they came either for the Egyptians or Malawi. Ah! Oh. Yes. Ahmed Abdu Kasi, 24 years of age, lying down in agony after colliding with Gilbert Chirwa. And they win a free kick. So that's quite a contrary. The Egyptian players are calling their officials, but the referee is actually telling them not to come in. Now eventually the referee has accepted and is telling his men to stop, stop watch. Do some work there. Yes, indeed. Zero, zero. And uh, Ahmed Abdu Kasi has come back on his feet. Now finished drinking water. And a free kick to the Egyptians inside Malawi half. About six meters away from the center circle. And Ashraf Kasem 24 to take that one. And it goes into touch. A goal kick to Malawi. There goes the high ball, headed back by Egyptians, picked up by themselves, and they are going. They leave the ball back, and this is Abdul Abd 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 Ghani, and again Tarek Soliman. This is Rogers Felix Nyirongo, should have taken his time there. He should have taken his time. He played it too quickly, but anyway, Right, the Egyptians are playing supporting football here. Well intercepted. Picked by Homan Malunga, a short one. Frank Sinalo. And again, brilliant ball up. Yes, uh, I think there is some sense indeed. Clifton, Clifton, a brilliant bow. Can't imagine. This is Clifton. You see, crossing it inside dangerously there. Oh.
Maybe his ex Rajab could have made something instead of single. The young and uh, uh, up, up, upcoming player, Abdul Ghani. Egypt. Yes, that's it. So the six minutes gone, nine minutes to go before the end of the first half. It's still zero zero. Egypt zero. Whatever. The referee got so anxious. He got so anxious and so emotional when he blew that whistle to give a free kick to the Egyptians, Ashraf Kassem. Their crosses are not something that one can enjoy at all. Fighting for a place in the World Cup Finals. The 1990 World Cup Final. There goes Frank Sinaro, it comes back. Reciprocated by Mpatsona Mari to find Frank. And again, the Egyptians marked up Lugani. Malawi freaking the ball back. But the Egyptians clear the ball into touch. There is a throw in, the Egyptians, Magda Brogani, the fellows, Clifton Msia picks up that loose ball, Clifton is going, Clifton is going, Buriri and staff, and again Pato, oh, oh! look at that, what a move! After 30 minutes, that was definitely in. And yes, the bench is not quite settled here. They nearly stood up. Because they know something was going to fall at the end of that. And now this is Mpats uh, Young Chimoti. Young Chimoti. Chimoti. Tumpatso. And uh, Frank Sinalo. And changing direction now in the process there. And Charles Piri tries his luck. Yes. It must be. But are we playing very well? And a free kick to be taken by Roman Malunga. And if we can only just put in one, that is enough. And Roman Malunga. Yes. Playing as the last man on the line of defense. Felix Nyirongo. Putting it into space, but it's headed back. Stopped again by Abdul Hamid. Ahmed Ramsey, but it goes away into touch. Five minutes to go. So far, so good for Malawi. There's no doubt about that. The boys have performed uh, brilliantly well here this afternoon. And this is now the Egyptians. Mark them. All you can do is just tightly mark them. No shot so far has been saved by Ganzani Masie. That's very ironic for the Egyptians. 
But so far, the goalkeeper for Egyptian is the busiest man on this today. Has saved a lot of crosses from either Clifton C.I., a lot of headers from Frank Sinalo. This is Abdulegani. Abdulegani still. This is Clifton. 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 Oh! This is beautiful play by Clifton in Syria. But well, the Egyptians have taken over. Let's see. Oh! <laughs> Tarek Suleiman wasting chance after chance for the Egyptians. A lovely ball there, bad job done by Egypt, and yes, it's indeed straight away a freak, a throw into Malawi on the western touchline. The hero of the Eastern Central Africa Senior Challenge Cup tournament, top goal scorer Peter Kinskaida taking that throw. Young Chimot, the scorer of the last goal of the Eastern Central, oh, oh no! Offside against the Sinalo. Yes, and it went into the night. It went into the night. At least Shobia has been able to pick one from the night. The Egyptians. Young Chimozi battling it out there. Heading it again to Gilbert Chirwa. Brilliantly played. Chested by the Egyptians. They headed forward in the center circle they are. There is. They beat a man in the process. And Clifton and Sia comes all the way back to the goalkeeper. They want to start it from there. Two minutes to go before the end of the first half. State of affairs, 0-0-0. Zero, zero, zero. Young Chimo, the captain. And here comes the scorer of the fight call. Magda Bragani. Back. Last man on the line of defense. Gilbert Chirwa floats a high one. And a brilliant header by Kipsia. Ah. They are in little trouble today, the Egyptians. Playing very well indeed. Malawi is definitely on top of this situation here. They have had the goalkeeper for Egypt coming to save a few close chances against nothing. And there's a blow on the gun. Oh, it comes away. For a corner it must be. No, it's so inside the field of play. Brilliantly done by the Egyptians now. Ah, oh, they beat their own man. Ah! No! This is unbelievable! It's exactly 45 minutes. It's exactly 45 minutes. No scores on either side. One player, Gamal Abdul Hamid, is injured for Egypt. Egypt to take a free kick almost halfway on either side in Malawi half. The end, yes, the end of the first half. The end of the first half. And at the end of the half, the first half here at 
Sivo Stadium. Yes, indeed, uh, you've just heard the two national themes. The first one was for Egypt, and the second one, of course, is for Malawi. Right now, the officials have gone to be introduced, and guest of honor is the Minister of Local Government, Ms. Honorable Mwanjas Mwakikunga, who is actually being introduced to the Malawi players first. Yes, to the officiating personnel. As I said earlier on, the referee is from Tanzania, Hafid Ali, and the first linesman is Joseph Mapunda, the second linesman is Sadi Alamas, and substitute referee is Sandesh Kandira from Malawi. But both the referee and the linesman are from uh, Tanzania. And right now, we ha the referee is from Tanzania, Hafid Ali, first linesman, Joseph Mapunda from Tanzania, and second linesman is Sa Said or Saidi Alamas from Tanzania. So it is indeed. Uh, if we can probably just go back a little bit to see how the Egyptians have fared against Malawi. Uh, in 1978 in Nigeria during the All Africa Games, uh, Egypt beat Malawi by four goals to one. But in 1987, Malawi beat uh, Egypt by two goals to one at the All Africa Games in, um, uh, at Nyayo Stadium in Kenya. And a moment from now, I think the two national anthems will be played. Makunga being introduced to the Egyptian players and uh, as usual yes you start with the visitors and then go to your own uh, team so right now the Honorable Makikunga and Mr. Nelson Chirwa who is the match commissioner is actually going to the Malawi national side Young Chimozi and uh, is actually introduced to Gilbert Chirwa McDonald Singo uh, Felix Nirongo Frank Sinalo Pato Namari, Ganzani Masie, who's got a very tough, difficult task. And, uh, yes, Homan Marunga, and uh, Peter Ginskaida, uh, Charles Piri, and indeed all the, all the players, and the uh, uh, team coaches, and the team doctor, and team, uh, team manager. So right now, um, this match, the one which everybody has been waiting for this afternoon, Good afternoon to you all. We are here at Sivo Stadium this afternoon in Nilongwe where Malawi is meeting Egypt in the world qualifying series and this is the first leg match. At the moment, the two teams have actually gone on the pitch and they are waiting for the officials to come and greet them or rather to be introduced to them. And uh, as far as I can see, the match commissioner is uh, uh, Mr. Nelson Chirwa the former Malawian referee um
and no so far no goals have been scored do you think we are going to see any goals today i think so you know this match is a uh, very important match for uh, egypt and for uh, malawi and it's like a final cup i think this match is very strong and your boys they play nicely and our boys also uh, and you don't know what will happen in the football you know the football if you play well you will win but today is very nice match and uh, do you think at the end of the day you'll be able to beat malawi the end of the day no we hope but we don't know you know football you don't know anything will happen now uh, uh, in 1987 malawi beat you in kenya uh, 2-1 and uh, uh, you, when, you, when you came here, definitely you were thinking of uh, taking that as a revenge. And if uh, uh, at the end of the first 45 minutes, the second 45 minutes, you don't get a goal, do you think you'll beat Malawi in August in Egypt? No, you know, it's, uh, you speak about two years before. But about today, you have best chance than us, better, because you play here with your supporters. And I see all the stadium is full. But we have the same chance second match. Do you think you beat Malawi in Egypt? I, uh, I, I told you before, football, you don't know what will happen. You don't know what will happen. We hope, but we don't know what will happen. Football is football. It's 90 minutes. Who will score goal, who will win? Can you single out the Malawi players who have impressed you, uh, the players of, from Malawi who have played very well in this first half? Yes, I think this first half time, they play well because they have a chance. They are, they are playing in the same country. You know, there's the same chance we will take it when we come back. But your teams, they play well. Thank you very much. That was Samir Adli, team manager for Egypt. The first half has just ended and now we're entering into the second half. And, um, and uh, right now Malawi is going to kick off this second half. And Egyptians have already made a change. There it goes. We are 10 seconds into the second half. Young Chimozi, the Egyptians send the ball back, chested and back. Yes, brilliant play there. And this is Homan Malunga. Homan, brilliant pass. And Clifton Sia goes to challenge. Yes, Hesham Abdel across. Gilbert Chirwa and gives it the opposition. And the shot picked up by the goalkeeper. Good save. The first shot so far by the Egyptians. And it's a free kick against them. So Malawi to take a free kick. Young Chimoz as the captain of the side, one meter from the center circle. And the bond it goes. It goes. But the goalkeeper gets it. One minute, 22 seconds. The Egyptians again on the offensive. And you can get that ball. McDonald Singo. Supporting football. Frank Sinalo. Ah, the brilliant header. Ah, this boy is so intelligent. But Kaira gives that ball away. Nevertheless, he has played brilliantly well this afternoon. No doubt about that, particularly when you consider the height of the Egyptians. He's managing to match them in the air as well as on the ground. Shabia, a long ball. Freak headed there, dangerously, and Hamidi. And now, oh, good save there for a corner. Corner number three to Egypt. The Egyptians taking a corner. A corner to be taken by the substitute Khaled Idi, 24 years of age. 
Khalid wearing shirt number 15. I can see the box is packed. They think they are actually playing short corners. That's too long. That's too long. A shot is actually going to the size of the leg, maybe. This is the hero of the Eastern Central Africa Senior Challenge Cup. Peter Kinskaida. A long, long ball from Gilbert Chirwa. And again, another free kick. Sinalo. Is it Sinalo? Yes, he's in trouble today. They know him quite well. The Zambians probably have been so unfortunate with Frank Sinalo. He's a player that if you give him a ball in the air, then you are in trouble. The Egyptians knew him. Uh, the, yes, the Zambians knew him when they had 10 minutes to go to the last half of the Eastern Central Africa when he scored that memorable goal which actually managed Malawi, uh, led Malawi to grab that and they chip inside there, Frank Snarrow and he's still inside the field of play Egypt chipping it high stopped badly there oh, you can't just imagine what is happening with the Egyptians today They have changed the shirts, the ones that we could easily see them as Egypt. This time they are wearing shirts which are not written in Egypt, but they are written in, is it, is it in Arab, Arabic. Maybe those shirts are going to bring some fortune. You never know. And they're taking a throw in from the western touchline. And Ibrahim Hassan. Ibrahim Hassan, they go, cut away, young Chimozi, brilliant job, but again the Egyptians send the ball back, and this is Felix Sinirongo, with all the time in the world sending the ball back to the goalkeeper, Ganzan Masie, and definitely the Malawi defense, on, oh, what a header, there is no one there, Mm. McDonald single. Oh, Gilbert Chirwa tens back. Felix White Mbato back, chipping it. Homan Malunga and again and Msia 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 and there is a loose ball now and yes. Magdi Abdulagani. Brilliant job. And he's now Clifton. Young Kimoti. A shot. There is Young Kimoti. Kimoti. What a brilliant ball. There is no doubt about that. I think. Beautiful game indeed. A very, very good game. I think the preparation has been very, very, uh, gone very, very well. I think they knew that they are playing one of the toughest sides in Africa. They are the All Africa Games champions as far as soccer is concerned. And this is now with no panic whatsoever. Patton Amari looked as he had four, four eyes and he managed Charles Piri. Yes, indeed. A very, very clean game. And Abdul Ghani is busy making a lot of noise. A good chip headed away. Gilbert Chirwa stops it first time, picked up by Egyptians. And again, they are playing supporting. Playing it at the diagonal there. And that is Homan Malunga trying his luck. Oh. <laughs> yes. And constitutional lifting of a leg by Homan Malunga. Warrants the Egyptians a free kick. 
and headed back and again on oh, no! yes yes that was a close chance for the Egyptians but all the time they're playing the ball over the bar unless they play the ball on the ground then something is going to happen we are almost 8 minutes 6 seconds it means 29 minutes And here come a long, long ball in the air. Back. Brilliantly done. This is McDonald single. McDonald beating a man. McDonald, young Chimoti. Oh! What a brilliant move. No two ways about it. Even, even their team manager has accepted that Malawi is playing very well. I'm very happy about that. This is Clifton in here now. Clifton, space. Oh. Homan oh, Malunga never anticipated that pass. Transferring the weight of attack. Park. Pato. Clifton. Now, what Clifton should do is definitely one of those things he did in Ivory Coast in 1984. Supporting football now to young Chimoza as captain of the side. Back to the goalkeeper. And one of them is wide, so he must make sure he gives it to him. No difference indeed, the standard is very, very high. Frank Sinalo goes on the ground. Egypt chesting it down, but cleared away already. Brilliant. Yes, this is survival of the fittest today. Short ball. Ibrahim Hassan. Chipping a high one. Malawi headed back, chested. Goalkeeper. Masie. McDonald single, flick heading it. The Egyptians are the first ones to arrive in the air. And this is Idi. Well intercepted by Malawi. Beaten in the air. Gilbert Chirwa putting the ball on the ground. Beating two men outright. Brilliantly done there. Peter Kinskaida tries his luck. But the Egyptians are too tall. Their leg got first to the ball. And this is now breaking away. Peter Kins. Ah. Egypt and now and now oh. why did you stop Charles that was the only chance for Malawi to score Piri should have just laid a death here on everybody else and just tried to push that ball in the net and listen from the referee what he was going to say and I'm sure he was going to accept it as a goal because there was nothing wrong with that here come Malawi pick up possession now 11 minutes 47 seconds gone Playing short one. Don't give them room. Good ball. Ironically, Clifton MC is heading a lot of balls today. And I want to remember he scored one against Swaziland here through a header. In 1987. When Malawi beat Swaziland by six goals to one. They're taking another corner, the Egyptians. Let us wait and see. Oh! 
And they have scored! After 13 minutes, Egypt has scored! Egypt has scored! So it's Egypt 1, Malawi 0. Yes, Hesham Abdul Rasul has scored for Egypt, and it was a brilliant ball. A very, very good goal. So it's Egypt 1. Malawi zero. Playing it short. Yes, indeed, it's a free kick to Malawi. Well, if they can go out with that. 1-0 lead then they cannot claim that they have played better than Malawi all they will accept is that they have just been fortunate to score that goal a good chip good ball chested The Egyptians are attacking, attacking again. That's definitely a push. Well, this is another chance for Egypt. Offside. And this is now or never. Yes, it must be a corner. Yes, indeed, that was a good shot by Charles Piri. At least there's some, the crowd can for he, forgive him after making that mistake of stopping before the referee blow the whistle and he didn't even know what had happened. And I'm sure if he managed just to go ahead, he should have scored that one. This is Homan Malunga taking a corner. Badly taken, yes, indeed. And Patramari, oh, and what a shot! What a shot! Sixteen minutes, fifty seven seconds gone. We still got some time, we can even beat them. There is do or die. They are again on the offensive. Dangerous. And we give away a corner. A corner again. Egyptians. And again they have got another chance. Ooh. 
Again another corner. Egypt taking a corner, headed away, comes back again. And it's gone in. Brilliant job. And they just want to defend that goal. That's what I've seen. A long ball. Headed. Nineteen minutes, thirty seconds. Gone in the second half. Still one zero. That's it, Frank. That's it, Frank Sinalo. Oh yes. The idea was good. But only the leg let you down. Beautiful play. Ah. Ninety nine point nine per cent balls from Egyptians have been blazed over the bar, except one. That's the way, that's the way. The Egyptians, this is Ab Abdul Ghani, young Chimozi now. Brilliantly done. This is now Ahmed Ramsey playing it short to Abdul Ghani. Magid Abdul Ghani. Oh, yes. Abdul Ghani is very dangerous. Still 1 0 to the Egyptians, they are taking a corner through Khaled Idi. Pass the way.
They're again on the offensive. This is young Chimozi. Pats on Amari. Back to the goalkeeper, Shabir. There they go. Oh, what a shot! Ay, 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 ay. Ahmed Abdul Kasi. Fired it so hard, and Ganimzani Masia has just proved himself that he's not a he's not a second choice goalkeeper just because he doesn't know the the, the, the trade well. But he's proving himself that he can perform wonders as well. Homan Malunga turning himself. Gilbert Felix Pato It was definitely good thinking only that he missed it Clifton and Sia Young Chimozi, Homan Malunga. There goes Gilbert to Young Chimozi. Just fight square there. And this is no. Oh, and Sinalo has missed it. And if you only allowed Sinalo to head it from that angle, then you're in trouble. Twenty six minutes, thirty eight seconds gone. Charles Pirit to take a corner. And he takes an in swinger. And Abdul Hamid plays the ball into touch. Gamal, but there he fails to head that ball, and Frank Sinalo takes over, a short one, and again, brilliantly done, and there they go now, can they fight straight there in the net, and, oh! They have been pinned, yes, the Egyptians, and this is young Chimozi. Chimozi, Chimozi, float it there, float it there, float, and it comes. Oh. Hesham Yakani was in trouble there with Peter Ginskaida. Yes. They're organizing an ambush attack here. 
I can see their number two is going on the right, Ibrahim Hassan. We just want to defend that one. 28 minutes gone. Hani Ramsey. A long ball. Supported. A cross there. Abdul Hamid. One zero and I can see the Egyptians are warming another player and it's Ramadan Frank Sinalo and Nine minutes gone. A long ball. Young Chimozi. what they are doing Frank Sinalo supporting with Clifton and again Sinalo Sinalo Beautiful Abdulagani That was a bad ball Ah oh. Apologize. Clifton Imsia is back. Yellow card. Yellow card to Ibrahim Hassan. After kicking Clifton Imsia. Oh, what a ball! Let us wait and see. 13 minutes to go before the end of the match. Muhammad Ramadan is going in. Young Chimoti, a powerful header. And this is Magda Abdulgani. Hesham. Young Chimoti, brilliant job. Beaten in the air. And there they go. Yes, Clifton. A corner again. Zex Lajabu to go in. Twelve minutes to go. Six plus six. Two 
2 plus 10, whatever. The Egyptians are taking a free kick, a corner. And again, cleared away by Sinaro. And Singo has gone to challenge. It goes to Gilbert. Gilbert Chirwa. Now it's looking for Clifton Msia, the Egyptians head it away, and again, yes, an interception there, back, Clifton, Clifton, brilliant job, Sinalo, to Singo, Gilbert, to Sinalo, Young Chimozi. Young. Oh. Back. Eleven minutes to go. Yes, Felix, Homan, Homan, two yellow cards. This time is to the scorer of the goal, Hesham Abdel Rasul. It's now or never for Malawi to equalize. I can see Homan Malunga, Peter Kinskaida, Young Chimoti. Charles Piri goes out. Zex Lajabu to go in. Zex Lajabu is going in. Last hope in hello. He moved. And it was a power packed shot. Power packed. Woo! Full stop. That's the way. When you miss the ball, don't miss the man. That's exactly what Gilbert Shiva had done. He knew he was beaten. The last thing to do was just to stop him. 8 minutes to go before the end of the match. So the Egyptians are leading by that goal to zero. Scored after 13 minutes. By Hesham Abdul Rasul. That's a gift to Zex Lachabu. Now these are the Egyptians with flawless interpassing. <laughs> well, it happens, it happens, it happens. In a game of football, it happens. Seven minutes to go. Brilliantly chested there. And this is 
Msia, but the ball zooms out into touch. Muhammad Ramadan. A man who combines well with Abdel Hamid and Abd uh, Mike Abdul Ghani. Watch out, young Chimozi. Chested Egyptians now on the offensive once again. Intercepted there beautifully. Picked up by Homan Malunga. And then they are beaten to the ball. And this is trouble now to the Egyptians. Of course, this is the Maui's dribbling wizard, Clifton in Sia. Young Chimozi waits for it on the ground and setting it. Ah! And, and you can't believe that. You can't believe that. You can't believe. With five minutes to go. Floating it high. And again. Yes. by Malawi. Beautiful. Five minutes to go. Shabia Chimozi Gilbert Abdulgani Just beyond them Young Chimozi playing it cool Yes, there is no doubt about that. The Egyptians are in trouble, serious trouble. Oh, everybody else may fail to make a header until. The goalkeeper, Shabia Ahmed, saved the Egyptians. Three minutes to go before the end of the match. Egyptians in the lead, 1-0. As the ball zooms out into touch for a throw-in. Again to Malawi, inside their half. On the western touchline, Patson Amari takes it. And this is Young Chimozi in the center circle. Brilliantly played there. And this is McDonald Singo. And again... The Egyptians now Ramadan with Khaled Idi back. Khaled Idi goes out. It comes in. Beautiful play there. 
Zex. Brilliant shot. Clifton in Sia sometimes takes corners which straight go into the net. And let us wait and see. And again, put it on the ground. Beautiful play. Oh, look at that. And you can't believe it. Bad luck. And now a chance, oh, it goes away. Corner. 30 seconds to go before the end of the match. Zambia, are, Egyptians are in big, big trouble. They are really in big trouble here. And it comes. the Egyptians who have we beat them in 1987. Today I think we are so unfortunate not to have won this game but the boys put in everything and you, they put in everything but good covering by the Egyptians was one of the things that you know Lady Luck deserted us. We should have won this game. And what do you think about the return match because I, as, as far as I've seen the Egyptian was saying uh, Malawians are playing better because they, they have got soccer fans. What do you think about the return match in August in Egypt? There's no worry, there's no worry. Whether at home or not, it's on the pitch that you play, 11 against 11. You know who have scored in the last minute because the game is played until the last minute. So all that I can say is, don't be tough in Cairo. We might even win. Thank you very much, Ruben. That was the Malawi uh, national coach, Ruben Malola, talking to me. Thank you very much. And indeed, from Sibo uh, Stadium in Lilongwe, where we have been covering this match on uh, video, uh, this is Moses Dossi. 30 seconds to go before the end of the match. Zambia, are, Egyptians are in big, big trouble. They are really in big trouble here. And here it comes! On! Oh!
and uh, right now Malawi is going to kick off this second half and Egyptians have already made a change there it goes we are 10 seconds into the second half Young Chimozi the Egyptians send the ball back chested and back yes Brilliant play there. And this is Homan Malunga. Homan. Brilliant pass. And Clifton Sia goes to challenge. Yes, Hesham Abdel. Across. Gilbert Chirwa. And gives it the opposition. And the shot picked up by the goalkeeper. Good save. The first shot so far by the Egyptians. And it's a free kick against them. So Malawi to take a free kick. Young Chimo as the captain of the side, one meter from the center circle and the bond it goes it goes but the goalkeeper gets it one minute 22 seconds the Egyptians again on the offensive and you can get that ball McDonald Singo Supporting football. Frank Sinalo. Ah, the brilliant header. Ah, this boy is so intelligent. But Kaira gives that ball away. Nevertheless, he has played brilliantly well this afternoon. No doubt about that. Particularly when you consider the height of the Egyptians is managing to match them in the air as well as on the ground. Shabia, a long ball. Flick headed there, dangerous there, and Hamidi. And now, oh, good save there for a corner. Corner number three to Egypt. The Egyptians taking a corner. A corner to be taken by the substitute. Khalid Eid, 24 years of age. Khalid wearing shirt number 15. I can see the box is packed. They think they are actually playing short corners. That's too long. That's too long. A shot is actually going to the size of the leg, maybe. This is the hero of the Eastern Central Africa Senior Challenge Cup. Peter Kins Gaida, a long, long ball from Gilbert Chirwa. And again, another free kick. Sinalo, is it Sinalo? Yes, he's in trouble today. They know him quite well. The Zambians probably have been so unfortunate with Frank Sinalo. He's a player that if you give him a ball in the air, then you are in trouble. The Egyptians knew him. Uh, the, yes, the Zambians knew him when they had 10 minutes to go to the last half of the Eastern Central Africa when he scored that memorable goal which actually managed Malawi, uh, led Malawi to grab that and they chip inside there, Frank Snarro and he's still inside the field of play Egypt chipping it high stopped badly there oh you can't just imagine what is happening with the Egyptians today They have changed shirts, the ones that we could easily see them as Egypt. This time they are wearing shirts which are not written in Egypt, but they are written in, is it, is it in Arab, Arabic. Maybe those shirts are going to bring some fortune. You never know. They are taking a throw in from the western touchline. And Ibrahim Hassan... Ibrahim Hassan, they go, cut away, young Chimozi, brilliant job, but again the Egyptians send the ball back, and this is Felix Sinirongo, 
with all the time in the world, sending the ball back to the goalkeeper, Ganzan Masie. And definitely, the Malawi defense. On oh, what a header! There is no one there. Mm. McDonald single. Oh, Gilbert Chirwa, tens, back, Felix, wide, Mbato, back, chipping it, Homan Malunga, and again, and Msia, 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 and there is the loose ball now, and yes, Magda Abdulagani. Brilliant job. And he's now Clifton. Young Kimoti. And no, so far, no goals have been scored. Do you think we are going to see any goals today? I think so. You know, this match is a uh, very important match for uh, Egypt and for uh, Malawi. And it's like a final cup, I think. This match is very strong. And your boys, they play nicely. And our boys also. Uh, and you don't know what will happen in the football. You know the football. If you play well, you will win. But today is very nice match. And uh, do you think at the end of the day you'll be able to beat Malawi? The end of the day? No, we hope, but we don't know. You know football, you don't know anything will happen. Now, uh, uh, in 1987, Malawi beat you in Kenya 2-1. Uh, and uh, uh, you, when, you, when you came here, definitely you were thinking of uh, taking that as a revenge. And if uh, uh, at the end of the first 45 minutes, the second 45 minutes, you don't get a goal, do you think you'll beat Malawi in August in Egypt? No, you know, it's, uh, you speak about two years before. But about today, you have best chance than us, better, because you play here with your supporters. And I see all the stadium is full. But we have the same chance second match. Do you think you'll beat Malawi in Egypt? I, uh, I told you before. Football, you don't know what will happen. You don't know what will happen. We hope, but we don't know what will happen. Football is football. It's 90 minutes. Who will score goal? Who will win? Can you single out the Malawi players who have impressed you? Uh, the players of, from Malawi who have played very well in this first half. Yes, I think this first half time they play well because they have a chance. They are they are playing in same country. You know, that's the same chance we will take it when we come back. But your teams they play well. Thank you very much. That was Samir Adli, team manager for Egypt. The first half has just ended and now we are entering into the second half. And a shot! There is young Chimoti. Chimoti! What a brilliant ball! There is no doubt about that, I think. Beautiful game indeed. A very, very good game. I think the preparation has been very, very, uh, gone very, very well. I think they knew that they are playing one of the toughest sides in Africa. They are the all Africa Games champions as far as soccer is concerned. And this is now with no panic whatsoever. Patron Amari looked as he had four, four eyes and he managed Charles Piri. Yes, indeed. A very, very clean game. And Abdul Ghani is busy making a lot of noise. A good chip headed away. Gilbert Chirwa stops it first time. Picked up by Gibsons. And again they are playing supporting. Playing it at the diagonal there. And that is Homan Malunga trying his luck. Uh. Yes, and constitutional lifting of a leg by Homan Malunga. Warrants the Egyptians a free kick and headed back. 
and again, Andrew! Yes. Yes. 